Big, Andy Ramage returns in place of Port the free kick. Aims it once again at Gilzean. Gilzean has it now. John Toll in with the challenge, but a brace kindly for Ian Gilzean. The cross by Andy Ramage. Mix up between O'Neill and Paul Whelan, and it's there. Brendan Aspinall gets it for Sligo Rovers. Eight minutes gone in this first half. And joy for the large contingent who have travelled from Sligo today. Aspinall opens the scoring. Here we see Ian Gilzean on it. He worked really well to get the ball. The cross from Andy Ramage. A mix up there between Alan O'Neill and one of the Shamrock Rovers defenders. And it was Brendan Aspinall who scored for Sligo. And here we see it from another angle. Quick thinking there by Ian Gilzean. The cross by Ramage. The mix up was between Alan O'Neill and Paul Osson. But it's blocked out by Dave Reed. Carlin's throw. On by Terry Everston. Well, the ball falls down to McGrath. McGrath with the shot and off the line. That was Robbie Brunton. Well, taking a big chance there, Adam O'Neill. And is it going to go in? It's there. Well, that's a free goal if you've ever seen one. 37 minutes gone in this second half. Adam O'Neill waited and waited. Ian Gildeen bore down on goal. The Shamrock Rovers keeper tried to clear it. It came off Gilzean, who's certainly making his presence felt. Oh, and a desperate tackle there by Gavin Dykes on Derek McGrath. McGrath retaliates while well, things now really getting heated out there. Well, Derek McGrath, and now Ian Gilzean is involved with O'Rourke. Kenny O'Rourke, a second half substitute. They're going head to head. Well, this really is unfortunate. As if things aren't bad enough at the RDS at the moment. These are not the sort of scenes we came along to see this afternoon. So Sligo Rovers, everything going their way this afternoon, but their disciplinary record certainly, once again, leaving a little bit to be desired. Mulligan again.